what's up everyone this is apple vibes back with another video and in this video i'm going to show you guys the best widgets for iphone and ipad in 2021 there are 10 widgets in this video feel free to start with any widget from the timestamps given in the description below and if you are into using your iphone or mac like a pro join me in my journey and also subscribe to my channel and without further ado let's dive in shall we Kicking off with the app which has been a lifesaver for me from quite a while now. Mail app on iPhone is trash and so Spark is a perfect replacement for mail app on your iPhone. It has a Mac app and now also has widgets which is super cool. I'm not going to go deep inside the app but this is a must have app. Now getting back to widgets, there are many widgets available for Spark, multiple widgets and we'll search Spark over here. New emails, email list and calendar and today email and calendar there are many widgets available for spark and the best part is they are available in different sizes so that's why i'm starting with spark because this is a must have app for iphone users moving on to the next app which is notion this app is a productivity beast and i have learned about this app from a youtuber known as ali abdal definitely check that out if you are into productivity you can do wonders with this app now the widgets are not that intuitive or not that colorful but the fact that notion has widgets now was worth mentioning in this video next in line is widget cal now this widget calendar adds everything from your apple calendar and reminders and other calendars all at once and sweetly shows your calendar as a widget on the home screen you have eight different options to choose from which is really great i have the calendar over here we'll move to widgets you have different options to choose from the best part is you don't have to set your schedule in this widget cal it will automatically update according to your apple calendar or reminders or other calendars and show that on the widgets which you will set on the home screen moving on to my favorite widget from this video which is known as social widget plus plus now being a digital creator i tend to check my social media accounts the followers and youtube subscribers from time to time but the problem is while i check my instagram followers from the app it kills a lot of time in that process in time pass and all that stuff so this widget plays a major role in saving huge amount of time you can see the widget on the home screen it is showing my instagram apple vibes page followers you can follow the account for daily updates to my youtube channel and setting it up is really easy just click on that widget or we'll go to the app and under accounts below you have an option on the top as add just choose that option and you have different social media platforms to choose from tiktok youtube or twitter just choose one of them next put your id save it and then go back to the home screen go to the widgets panel search for social media set the widget and after setting it up 3d touch on the widget edit widget you'll have an option if you have set two three accounts like twitter and instagram and youtube just press on this it will give you all the options choose one of them and it will set that account and it will track your account directly from the home screen next we have is daily budget original now this is a killer app and a widget it can literally help you to organize your financial life and it really works trust me all you have to do is just set your expenses and mark your income or better you can just come over here and set a daily budget whatever you want whatever you feel like is perfect for you just set the daily budget and it will remind you every day what's your spending capacity for that day now the widgets are not that colorful or you don't have in all three sizes you just have two sizes and two colors but the point over here is not the widget the point over here is that this widget on your home screen can really help you a lot moving on to daily random facts now this may sound like just an extra widget to have but the random facts are just amazing sometimes it leads me to search more about that topic on google which eventually ups my knowledge now this is the app i'm talking about facts and i have a widget for facts on my home screen it says the name wendy was made up for the book peter pan there was never a recorded wendy before it now this is a really weird and a random fact but if you read it properly it will 100 percent up your knowledge this is something new to have in your knowledge so we'll go to this app when you download this app it will ask for your preferences just give the preferences after doing that we'll go to our widgets panel search for facts and it has three options it has in custom and standard the matter is going 
going to be same in all of them just the text size will differ in all the three options so you can choose one of them set it on your home screen and you're good to go next up is widget box like other thousand custom aesthetic widgets out there this is also a good one and personally the option it has for customizations are fab and up till now i found this app to be the best we'll go to the app and for the widgets to work for you first you'll have to go to the app set your widgets and then you can put that widgets on the home screen so you have three options small widget medium and large i have set two small widgets over here we'll set one more you can see the options it provides it has gradients and colors motivation codes calendar contacts battery system tracking ram storage cpu it has many options and the best part is you can customize each and every option according to your preferences and set it up on the home screen i have two widgets set i have two widgets already made so after doing that i just have to go to the home screen and search for widget box and has the three options just choose one of them and after doing that you just have to come to your home screen haptic press on that widget widget box edit widget box and choose from one of the widgets you have set so i have two battery and storage for example i'll choose battery and it will put that widget on the home screen very convenient next up is word of the day a very simple yet powerful widget for almost every person on earth including einstein no matter how good your english is this app will help you develop your english more and more so you'll have to set your preferences when you download this app you install this app you it will ask for preferences after setting it up just go to the widget section search for word of the day you'll have two sizes available the bigger size i don't think is any different from the smaller one so i think this is a good size to go for and set this widget on your home screen and you'll learn a new word every day in your life next up is transparent widget if you don't like your home screen cluttered or if you don't want everything on the top of your screen well then this widget will help you out but setting it up is a bit tricky so don't miss this part we'll have to go to the widget twid transparent widget and for this to work first we'll have to go to the jiggle mode and then swipe right to the end of the screen when you'll find it empty and we'll take a screenshot that will get saved to the photos app and then again we'll have to go to the transparent widget app and we'll have to select a screenshot for this to work the empty screenshot that we took we'll just select that screenshot and done now again we'll go to the jiggle mode we'll go to our widgets panel we'll search for transparent widget twid and we'll choose from one of them if we, i want a medium size one i'll say add this widget it will kind of camouflage with my home screen and now you can see that my that the upper part of my screen is empty and everything has come to the bottom of the screen so if i don't have this widget everything will be at the top of my screen so this can be useful for customization purposes next is cpu x it's just stats that's all but very useful cpu x over here you don't have to go to the app to set it up just go to the widgets panel after downloading the app of course and you have two options traffic statistics and hardware and very weirdly you also have one more option as flip clock but that's not the purpose for this app now hardware is not that useful traffic statistics is a bit useful and the bigger widget is obviously much more better because it provides mobile data data and land data so if you want to download this app just set this widget on the home screen and you are good to go so this is all for this video guys if you like the widgets in this video give this video a like and also like share and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching this video and before leaving i'd like to know on what do you want me to make my next video on my productive widgets or productive shortcuts or something like that leave that in the comment section below thanks for watching this video my name is mufaddal this is apple vibes take care and i will see you in the next video